के साथ मैं पूरी टीम को बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद देती हूँ धन्यवाद श्री राजमोहन उन्नीतन जी जी प्लीज हो गया हो गया यस 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 थैंक यू वेरी मच सर सर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विश टू कंग्रेचुलेशन द सिविल एवियस मिनिस्टर मिस्टर ज्योतिरादित्य सिंधिया एंड स्टेट मिनिस्टर वी के सिंह फॉर द इवैक्यूएशन प्रोसेस ऑपरेशन गंगा एंड एट द सेम टाइम आई अपोज डिमांड्स फॉर ग्रांट अंडर द कंट्रोल ऑफ सिविल एविएशन for 2022 and 23 sir when we buy a product we give money and take the product and when we sell the product we give money and take uh, take uh, we give the product and take uh, collect the money but bjp government sells air india and also give money to buyers air india is sold and no money has come to government but still 68000 crores spent if we could have given this money to air india we can retain air india with the government the government of india have favored private people like tata so i i am strongly opposing the privatization of the government sir i urge upon the government to take immediate steps to save kannur international airport by taking urgent following measures grand point of call status to kannur international airport in order to permit international operations by foreign carriers from kannur the honorable minister for civil aviation in response to uh, unstar question number 715 dated 21 11 denied its permission stating that kial is an interior point however kial is situated in municipal town within the city limits of kannur corporation the catchment area extends across north balabar region including kurk mysore and mangalore with 30% of non resident kerala is in, or, in other words kannur is not an interior area on the other hand the revenue of kial is drastically affected due to the lack of international operations by foreign carriers without point of call the airport is finding it difficult to recover its investment which includes a bank loan amount rupees 90 100 crores increase wide body aircraft operation during the covid pandemic kial has proved its metal with the successful operation of wide body aircraft both indian and foreign carriers unlike calicut airport the length of runway is conducive for the same apart from catering to the length demand wide body aircraft helps to significantly increase the volume of cargo export from kannur sir the largest number of muslim pilgrims in kerala come from north malabar region unfortunately there are no hajj embarkation point in the region so may kannur airport as hajj embarkation point sir exempt kial from payment reimbursement for central government services including customs immigration meteorological and ai until the airport is granting point of call kannur airport is struggling to survive without point of call status until this status is granted by government the airport should be exempted from making payment reimbursement for all central government services post on central government officer for plan quarantine post full time apho at kannur international airport sir the government of kerala has acquired around 18 acres of land at peria in kasargod district for an air strip sir please take necessary step to sanction an air strip in peria very near to world famous tourist icon bakel fort thank you very much sir singh ji